It's Tatiana, and this is the perfect time once again. Can you believe it? We're already here at the end of the year. This is the perfect time to continue talking about manifestation. Now, I've shared already some really great techniques to bring in what you want to create. So we've covered writing your goals down and how magical that is when you look back a few months, six months, couple years and see that just from the process of writing things down, you created them. So that's one technique. Another technique is creating your own ritual or ceremony around what you want to bring in for the year or whenever you're manifesting. So around the time of the full moon is a great time for that, three days before the full moon or three days after the full moon, where maybe you might take your list outside and say it and light a candle safely. Another great technique that we already talked about is getting a special crystal that calls out to you a manifestation crystal where you can take your list and put it underneath the crystal and set your intention for what you want to create. So in honor of this time of year and how exciting it is, another great manifestation tool, and I love this one because it's fun. And I feel like we are really in a place now around the world to step into our lives, step into our life purpose, and really enjoy our lives, enjoy what we're doing. So that's why I love this manifestation tool. So what you want to do is create a vision board. And vision boards are really magical as well. And get yourself a a poster or some kind of backing where you can begin to take pictures that you've cut out from magazines, things that mean something to you. Start cutting out images of what you want to create for the year, possibly what you want to look like, what you want to feel like, where you may want to visit, what you want to create in your career, perhaps you want to move. So there you go, you've got some great manifestation tools for the coming year. And another great technique is to call on a goddess or an ascended master or even an angel that resonates with you as far as bringing in what you want to create. And a really great ascended master that I like to work with is Ganesh. And Ganesh is the Hindu god invoked in all Hindu ceremony. He is the first god invoked. And so this ascended master is known for the removal of all obstacles in your path. So I recommend calling on Ganesh to bring in what you want to create. Happy New Year, Happy Holidays, and I'll talk to you soon.